The Lupid Pipe is a device to cool satellites and their elements. At Leonardo we are very much excited about this uh, big innovation that is possible thanks to graphene that is uh, enhancing the capabilities of traditional lupid pipes. CNR is uh, involved in a uh, graphene flagship uh, to produce, uh, to grow graphene, uh, to improve the property of material, in this case uh, to improve the property of the lupid pipes. I'm very excited to join the, the parabolic fly when we will test uh, the sample that we produce. During this uh, third campaign we hope to finalize the first set of experiments and confirm the promising results we got so far that the uh, device uh, incorporating graphene by liquid phase exfoliation or by chemical vapor deposition has a performance up to 800% higher than the state of the art. Also in a very challenging environment like the space exploration, the Graphene flagship is able, in partnership with industries like Leonardo, to promote great innovation at world level. The collaboration between the European Space Agency and the Graphene flagship is getting stronger since we started over two years ago and the next step is to develop high technology readiness level devices that hopefully will soon fly on a satellite. Parabolic flight was only the first step in order to test graphene in space. In June we will test the same device even during a sounding rocket campaign that will be held in Kiruna in north of Sweden. The sounding rocket campaign will last six minutes, so we will have a full six minutes of microgravity. During these six minutes we will test fundamental sciences based on graphene and especially how the application of graphene can enhance thermal management and devices for human space exploration.